Mission is supported by the Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid and the EU. The construction of a two single story dormitory block at the Drobonso Community School in the Setre Afram Plains district of the Shanti region is progressing steadily. The Community Day Senior High School, built under the tenure of former President John Mahama, is being converted into a boarding facility. The first batch of students are expected to be admitted in the school in September this year. The Drobonsu Community Day Senior High School was part of second cycle schools constructed by the as well John Mahama administration to expand access to secondary education in Ghana. However, most of the schools constructed are yet to take in students three years after its completion. At Drobonsu in the Setre Afram Plains district of the Ashanti region, the school had not been occupied because of its location about seven kilometers from the main township. Students in order to access the school would have to trek long distances. When TV3 Mission visited the community in November last year, the district chief executive of Setra Fram Plains promised work on the dormitory block would commence. In February this year, TV3 Mission returned to the project site. Work is currently ongoing for the construction of a two-story boys and girls dormitory at the Drobonsu Community Day Senior High School. When completed, the Community Day Senior High School will be converted into a boarding facility. Your first story on the Senior High School and why it's still not opened uh, brought a lot of light to what has happened to those uh, legacy E block. And uh, from your coverage, a lot of people showed interest in knowing what is happening with the e-block and the concept of the community day. This government under His Excellency Nanado Dankwe Kufuadov was benevolent enough to recommend to the Minister for Education to vary the day community for such a farm place to a boarding facility. The facility is expected to increase enrollment in senior high schools by students who complete junior high school in the district. The construction of the two-story boys and girls dormitory is expected to be completed by September 2020 to admit the first intake of students. We are strongly pushing for the contractor to hurry the works up so that we can have the boys and girls dormitories in place and the minor ancillaries to go with it to ready the school for intake in September. So hopefully September, all things being equal, the original intended community day e-block SHS for drop on so community and by extension such as farm planes will see light of day. But it won't be a day school as it was originally intended under the previous administration.